Last round, people. Very good. Cards, so I'm just gonna go all in. Again. All right. All in. What about you? We're going all in. You got two. You just pick first. I have a pair of tens. Very nice. I'm out. I got two kings and three queens. What's the probability of getting this hand? I can help you with that. Why don't you oh, come good. on over here? Before we compute the probability of that, there are some formulas that you need to know. First of all, the probability of E, which is the number of elements in E over the number of elements in S. And the probability of E is between 0 and 1. And S equals a sample space, which is a total number of possibilities. Another formula that you need to know is the choose function, which is denoted nr, equaling n factorial over r factorial n minus r factorial, which is the number of combinations of r distinct objects taken from a set of size n. Here's a quick example. A choose 3, where a equals n and 3 equals r, which equals a factorial over 3 factorial times 8 minus 3 factorial. When you simplify and do the whole problem out, you get 56 possible ways to choose 3 out of 8. Now let's go ahead and work on your problem. So your problem is the probability of 3 queens and 2 kings. So first we're going to work on the denominator because in your P of E function it's the number of elements in E over the number of elements in S. So how many different cards are in a deck? There's 52. So for your choose function, n would equal 52. And how many cards were you dealt? Five. So r would equal five. So what would your choose function be for the total number of possibilities? Uh, 52 choose 5? Yes. Now let's work on the numerator. So how many different queens are in a deck? There's four queens. Right, and we want three. So what would your choose function be? Four choose three? Correct. Now let's move on to the kings. Again, there are four kings in a deck, and how many do we want? Two. So your choose function would be? Four choose two. Correct. Now go ahead and calculate the numerator. Uh, 24. And the denominator for me? Two, five, nine, eight, nine, six, zero. Which equals? Point zero 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 nine two three. So you have a point zero 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 nine two three percent chance of getting three queens and two kings. Oh wow! Thank you. You're welcome. Yes, I won. Congratulations, sir. Thank you. <laughs> now get out. <laughs>